Welcome back for some more Hogwarts Legacy. Yes, today we're clearing up this issue with the, the troll, which is apparently living next to a very large castle and area. Interesting. In church. Yeah, I know I can't enter it. Well. I take it you're Alexandra's friend. Yeah, and I'm also going to assume that like god this is cool man this town has some cool stuff in it Revelio. yeah I, I see that oh I see giant spiders oh we have uh, kitty cats over here so this is like a straight up, like, cool beast area. Yeah, so it's, what are these things? The cats, right? Yeah, because we're up here. Now, what is that? Is that a skull? I can't tell. Alexander's Troll, yeah. And then we have a Neasel Den, and a Spider Lair, and a... Ancient magic hotspot. Alright, well, we'll look at that after we deal with the troll. Sorry, buddy. Oh, yeah. Expel the armor, defend us. Couldn't bring us. Protect us. Stupid fun. Yeah, I'm sorry, Bonnie. Whoa! Stupid fight! Expelliarmus, defend us! Stupid fight! Confringo, bombard them! Saved from that troll. Holy cow. And of course, that. <laughs> oh, that, that was silly. All right. All right, all right. Let's go find this ancient magic source. So we can go in here. And find nothing. I feel like this is a little bit of a wasted POI. Look how freaking awesome this is. Is it used for something else? <gasps> Ooh, what is this? Akio! Now oh, here's a sad looking place. Where do we think 
Well, okay. Hold on. Well, this is an interesting puzzle, but I don't know how to get it started. Can't push it. Two different tracks. Revelio. I mean, maybe it has to be activated in some way. It's kind of a bummer. Ah, this isn't even active. Which is dumb because it's awesome. Incendio. Hello, sp Hello Accio. spiders. Incendio. Oh, you know what? Hold on. We're by ourselves. <laughs> yeah, yeah, point yourself at me. Okay. There we go. Lumos. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Bombarda. Okay. Revelio. Expelliarmus. I can't free that person. That's jacked up. Bombarda. Confringo. Interesting. You're the one who stole our goblin helm. Well, their goblin helm, but then it was ours. <laughs> okay. That's an Ashwinder who's just trapped it. Glad I was never locked up here. <sighs> That's it? to use the dark arts, haven't you? Sensing, I'm afraid of you. Okay, alright, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Protego! No, landing is available. You let me in here. There we go. That solves that. Okay. Revelio. Very cool. Kitty cats. Does that unlock this though? Confringo! Wingardium Leviosa! Accio! Now. Okay. Well, that's. Uh, okay, let's go turn in. Yeah. Let's go turn in. You avoided my thrall. It's done, Alexandra. 
I took care of him. My troll? What? Oh, I don't know what to say. Thank you. I wish things could have turned out differently for him. There wasn't much he could have done. He was beyond training. Tried to kill me the entire time. Goodness. I'm glad you're all right. You're very brave. People in the hamlet had already crafted a moniker for whoever eventually defeated my... I mean, that troll. It was troll something or other. Slayer? Yes, that was it. <laughs> you get to choose it. I suppose it's your title now. I need some time on my own. But truly, thank you for what you did. <laughs> well, all right. Troll Slayer. Has a nice ring to it. Could it be a Merlin trial? It's always a Merlin trial. Let's see what we got. What does this one have for us? Revelio. What? That was weird. I mean, we got all kinds of things, but I don't. If only I could invent a new potion. I can't get it. There we go. Now, where on earth are the pieces of this trial? Let's do a little Rebellion. look see here. Okay. No. Huh. I am completely unsure as to what that is. Ooh, that was a good find. Alright, well, I'm not going to worry about it. Not going to worry about it. Let's see what we can do here. If we were to go for a quest, what quest would we do? I have no interest in that. Let's go talk to our boy in the Undercroft. Hogwarts. Yeah, let's see. What's what's closest? Is this? No. Let's see. Maybe this. No, definitely not that. Ugh. All right, it's got a ah. There we go. Boom. Hopefully that's good enough. That'll get us there. And then we'll go talk to our boy, who's out of control, and I'm definitely pushing him over the edge. Do you even comprehend how expensive that room was? Breaking your own belongings. But that room belonged to your sister, and I'll have you know that she. Oh, howlers. Tell your kid good day. That's kind of messed up. Alright, here we are. She's devastated. She just buried your uncle alone. I did it for her. Sebastian, Anne can't bear the thought of turning you in, but... What? Turn me in? She saw what happened. I'll give you some time to think, Sebastian. Turn me in.
Sebastian. Did you hear that? You saw what happened. I never wanted to hurt my uncle. I know. I can't believe he's gone. How did things go so wrong? I didn't mean it. I didn't mean to... Oh, and I was only trying to help. I can't leave now. Anne needs me more than ever. You understand. You can talk to Ominous. Make him understand. He listens to you. I need to be with Anne. <laughs> I don't know how that's going to work, but... Okay. Don't worry, Sebastian. I shall speak with Ominous. Thank you. You're a good friend, truly. You're a murdering psychopath. No matter what happens from here, I'm glad we met. Poor Sebastian. Ominous? What a mess. I can't believe it. After I last saw you, I went straight to Hogwarts. Before I had time to talk to Black, I heard from Anne. I rushed to Feldcroft and found her with Solomon's body. She was beside herself with grief. Part of her wants Sebastian to face the consequences, another part can't bear the thought of it. I don't want to lose Sebastian, but I don't think we have a choice. There you go. Do you betray your friend for legal? Are you the golden angel? We do have a choice. What good will it do to turn him in now? He clearly regrets everything. He's not going to do anything like this again. We've both heard that before. But we also need to think about Anne. She's lost her health. Now she's lost her uncle. Do you really want to take her brother away from her too? I, I understand what you're saying. Perhaps you're right. As much as I believe that Sebastian should pay for his actions, we'd only be punishing Anne as well. I hope we're doing the right thing. I'll talk to Anne. If it comes from me, she'll agree with this decision. Thank you, Ominous. You're a good friend. Whatever lies ahead, we must face it together. That I know. Well, all right. Ah, uh, the triptych. All right, well, okay, what else do we have to do? What else? Let's see. Well, we could go do this. I don't really want to. It gives clothing. We could... We're only a couple of levels below this. We could go sex Selwyn. Ah, <sighs> or... Or... Oh, let's go talk to this guy. Um, yes. Oh. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Map, let's go. Going to Hogsmeade. That's going to be the end. <laughs> I don't know where in Hogsmeade this cat is, but we're going to Hogsmeade. Let's find out about the moons. Oh, hello, my moons. Okay, okay, here we are, here we are, let's go. Am I going the wrong way? My fingers are weird. Here we go. Oh yeah, transport. Aloha Mora. Because I have level three. Now I can truly ransack this town, to be fair. I have not gone back through and done it. Revelio. Oh. Oh, that was worth it, baby. Gib the new outfit. All right. This is the wrong house. <laughs> All right, where was I supposed to go? Oh, here he is. Pardon me, sir, but about those curious demiguy statues I've seen. What? Who are you? Why do you ask? They're causing Mr. Moon terrible distress. Ha! Good. That was the idea. So you did create them. I... <sighs> 
Yes, I did. It was a ploy to give that pathetic oaf Moon a taste of the grief he caused me years ago. You are the one who's been pilfering them. I am, at the request of Mr. Moon. I received your owl on your stationery. <clears throat> ah, well, fitting Moon would enlist a student. Too cowardly to do it himself. <laughs> Hasn't changed a bit. Even when we were at school, he was a cowardly bully. Gave me a horrible nickname, which I shan't repeat. I was thrilled when we left school and he seemed gone for good. Then I started seeing him around Hogsmeade. It was too much. Even if I do take satisfaction in that his life's destiny was to be a lowly caretaker. I mean, okay, geez. Mr. Moon does a good deal for the school, and he's taught me a lot. He's terrified of those statues. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you should have seen his face when that boggart appeared. Oh, priceless. That's when I knew what I needed to do. I simply didn't want to encounter him anymore. So, I shrewdly put a boggart in his path to learn his greatest fear. I then created the demiguy statues to keep him in his place, so to speak. The moons were an inspired play on his name. It worked brilliantly. Until you started clearing them out. The statues are a form of bullying. You're no better than him. Perhaps it's time you both moved on. <sighs> Fair point, I suppose. If they've terrified him, as you say, he may have learned his lesson. All right. Talk to Glad. Protego. Oh, Protego. Gladwin Moon. I do want to walk around here though now and find all the level three locks. Nope. 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 Oh, maybe. This is a normal house. I think I've already. Rebellion. Rip this place off. Look, you with the hat, chill out. Okay, let's go talk to Moon, and we'll put this bad boy to bed. If I can ever remember where he is. I know he's near, let's see. Yeah, he's in there. He's near the Grand Staircase Tower. I knew that, but I don't know. You know, it's always a pain in the ass to find people in this map, especially Hogwarts. It's crazy. It's a bloody maze. All right, he's below. All right, here we go. Going, 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 going. Oh, keep it up. Keep it up. Can you imagine trying this in, in real life? <laughs> the stairs just barely making it in front of you. Ooh. Here we go. And there we are. Mr. Moon, I've learned who's behind the demiguy statues. It was a classmate of yours that you bullied. Piers Pemberton. Oh, I might have known. Pigtails Piers. I don't think he likes being called that. Of course he does. Oh, we had such flowing locks. Oh, we used to laugh about them. <laughs> I laughed the hardest of all. Clever, clever man. Hmm? I'd no idea he was so devious. <laughs> I must go and congratulate him. Whatever statues remain seem less terrifying now that I know they were put out by old pigtails. Continue collecting them if you like. As for me, I'm going to go and pay a visit to my old friend. Huh. Well, there you go. He didn't learn his lesson, I don't guess. 
Oh, goodness. Well, that is it for this episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Come check out Ammo. Play some games with us, and I'll see you in the next one. Later!